Well, there have been a lot of rumors about whether the National Guard is here, if they're going to be implementing a shelter in place order. Two on your side, Steve Brown was out today to get some answers about that and put these rumors to rest. We're outside the Connecticut Street Armory here in Buffalo to talk a little bit about the National Guard. I've been inside and had conversations with people here. I've also had telephone conversation with the state National Guard headquarters. There is some concern and it appears to be unwarranted about what the National Guard might be up to in regards to what's happened in other cities with shelter in place orders that have been uh, instituted. Here's what they're telling me, both inside here and at state headquarters, that none of that is planned for here, that all of the missions that they're doing currently are, are described as administrative missions, like logistical supply, making sure that services are getting to the people who need them. And all of this is taking place right now downstate. Um, there are medics that are doing work at the drive-by clinics, again, downstate, and they're operating in a support capacity, again, downstate. But none of those units, although they've been activated, have been mobilized or asked to take on a mission here in the Buffalo area. And to those who are concerned that somehow the National Guard would be enforcing some sort of civil shelter in place order, please understand this. The statewide spokesperson for the National Guard, Eric Dunn, says this, that they stopped doing training for civil disobedience or civil disturbance some time ago. So the National Guard units as constituted in this state don't perform that mission. Currently, they're an administrative supportive capacity and all at work right now downstate. Outside the Connecticut Street Armory, Steve Brown, Channel 2 News.